Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Good morning Best wish to all of us The Honorable Al Komit and participants at International Conference on Fracture and Structural Integrity 2021 Please allow me Shinji Diprasetyo from Universitas Blas Maret Indonesia represent other authors to present the results of our research. Our research is regarding investigation of sulfur melter heating coil as an industrial product, a study case on technical design and structural inspection. In this presentation, I will discuss four points, namely the background of the problem, research method, research results, and the conclusion of the research conduct. The development and application of technology in recent time are very rapid, including in industrial community. For the reason, it is necessary to prepare skilled human resource to accommodate this progress. Therefore, its individual needs to enhance their interest in the applied knowledge that has been used in industry. Based on record history, the company always becomes excellent ecosystem for this activity. And in the same time, it successfully improves the quality of product to achieve the research target. One of them is a heater to heat a fluid. The heater adds heat energy to the fluid flow through the mechanical process. Heater appears in many forms. Example boiler, superheater, reheater, combustion chamber or nuclear reactor. Heat transfer in a heater occurs through radiation of and convection on the surface of the pipe. Heater or usually called call as a furnace is processing equipment that is useful for raising the temperature of a material. In several installation, the oil economizer section, the air preheater section, or both are installed above the vertical heating section. The purpose of the economizer and air heater section is to improve the economic of operation by increasing thermal efficiency. The cathode element must reach the required temperature for the tube to work properly. This is why old electronic devices often need time to warm off up after being turned on. Cathode heater is a coil or filament used to heat the cathode in a vacuum tube or cathode tray tube. Before the transistor and its integrate surrounding are connected, electronic equipment use a vacuum tube to power its elements. A simple type of vacuum tube operates as a diode, which only gives flow in one direction. If the positively charged node is related to the cathode, the radiating electrons will attract in the current will flow. Based on this, the author are interested to discuss the sulfur melter as industrial product. The heating coil fabrication process include a manufacturing process, material estimation, and the quality control testing which give assumes design flow is in one direction. 
fabrication of heating coil product is needed to adjust to its operational use, including its technical performance. Considering the of material and structural factor in them, the current study discussion is direct to fabrication process and structural inspection. The material classification is need the fabrication of heating coil which the in this study the classification summary is present. Broker classification in the manufacturing process of sulfur melter include several worker for designing activity. The first is drawing which is to describe the work piece that has been planned by the customer for further processing in engineering department. The second is machining which is carried out by the operator. The third is welding in which the worker operates the welding machine to connect parts that need to be joined through welding process. The fourth is fitting which is a stage to perform an assembly or adjustment work for all work in the workshop. The deployed primary machine in the sulfur melter heating coil fabrication process are the plasma cutting machine, the bending pipe machine, the welding machine, and the grandy grand as illustrated in figure. At the same time, the auxiliary machine in the fabrication process are hand grinding machine and drilling machine. Manual, uh, the material used for fabrication are classified based on its part. In this case, it is divided into 10 parts. R is as in the following table. Material specification are tolerated to exciting fabrication need. The method for the current study is action research which aims to improve the method ways of practicing in the observation process. Various method and approaches have been developed to enhance the process of developing a new product. One of them is the basic principle of design for manufacturing and assembly, which is to optimize the initial product design process in the design concept stack to ensure the product can be product quickly. In this process, product design is simple by changing the feature to match the capability of the manufacturing facility. This includes change in the integration of the design and development of traditional organization process and structure to conform to the principle of the DFEM. 2D drawings are created and cannot be duplicated by outsider in the form of CAD. Image products from requests based on exciting library design. Several 2D models of sulfur metal heating coil are present in figure, cover, slough nozzle, and assembly. The execution of the process through several manufacturing process including welding in the coil to coil itself, expanding the cover, pipe bending, and plate boring which is done by turning, bending boring, grinding, marking, assembling, and finishing process. The manufacturing process of sulfur melter heating coil that will be discussed is the process of making the main component coil, cover, and self nozzle. The process is intended by preparing coil, cover, and self nozzle material in the form of 
pipes, plates, and eel blow following the needs and specification based on the specific material, as shown in figure. Then the process is continued by cutting several basic components, pipe, plates, and elbow according to the length of the design says using plasma cutting. The pipe plan will be formed in, into a coil by rolling, as shown in figure. The rolling process is carried out by one machine operator and one assistant. The method of making the cover plate is almost the same, namely cutting the plate, welding, punching, and bolting following the design. The process to manufacturing self and nozzle is conducted by bending the pipe, connecting its part, and grinding using a uh, hand grinding machine. The result of making self and nozzle are preset are present in figure. Bolt is connecting component with a round and thread thread, one end formed by the head of a bolt, and the other end is mounted with a nut or lock. Usually, bolts are used to make the construction of fixed connection, mobile connection, or temporary connection. That can be dismal removed again. The shape of bolt rod for steel contraction is generally triangular threads, namely as fastening bolts. In this process, the bolt connection is used to connect the coil to the L plate cover as shown in figure. The distance between the bolt has been set based on the design drawing. This connection tab using a bolt is used to maintain the gap between the coil that has been formed. Therefore, there is not connect between the coil welds which will be dangerous if the inner coil is too close. Fitting and checking part of the heating coil which will then be connected with welding are present, are present in figure. Inspection of the sulfur metal heating coil uh, is a mandatory which aims to make the part that have been done by fabrication following the specific standard. The inspection, pro the inspection process is carried in several stages, namely dimensional inspection, penetrant, penetrant test, and fulling handling. Dimensional inspection is an examination carried out to check all dimension of the component. Penetrant tests are performed to determine whether crack occur in the sulfur melter heating coil component or the welding result. If there is a crack, the repairing process will be conducted. The inspection process is described as following with standard in Table will simple result of the inspection. In so in table with the tail sheet is summarized. The fabrication process of sulfur melter heating coil that has been carried out include manufacturing coil, cover, and self nozzle. The material used is carbon based in the form of pipe and plate. The machine used in fabrication are plasma cutting machine. Bending pipe machine, gas tension, are welding, welding machine, grindy crane with auxiliary device, namely hand grinding and drilling machine. To determine the feasibility of product results, dimensional inspection, penetrant test, full annealing, and final dimension inspection are carried out. Examination result based on dimension. dimension inspection and penetrant test indicate that the manufacture product is following existing standard. Thank you for attention.
Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.